This Saturday is the Susan G. Komen Race for the Cure. And in tonight's Prescription Arkansas Report, we're talking about new technology being used to diagnose breast cancer. It's called an MRI guided breast biopsy. And as Ann Jansen tells us, it's helping catch breast cancer in its earliest stages. You're watching new technology at work. Dr. Joe Stuckey, a radiologist, is performing a breast biopsy. What makes it unusual is he's doing it while the patient is having an MRI. The biopsy that we perform under MRI guidance is done in the same uh, environment where we do all of the ever, other uh, MRI examinations that we, uh, we do at the hospital. In the past, the magnetic properties of the MRI prevented the use of metal needle biopsy equipment. That meant they had to try to do it using a mammogram or ultrasound as a guide, which didn't always work. Potentially, MRI is capable of uh, identifying abnormalities that can't be seen with uh, mammography, they can't be seen with ultrasound, and in those circumstances, a uh, physician needs to have a way to be able to actually get tissue from that abnormal area and determine whether or not that represents a benign or malignant lesion. Not only that, but if it is cancer, the MRI-guided biopsy can help determine what stage the cancer is in. This method of biopsy is not only better for doctors, but for patients as well. Minimally invasive, tiny scar, local numbing medicine so that the patient doesn't have to be put under general anesthesia and doesn't have to worry about, you know, an inch or inch and a half long scar just to determine whether something is benign or cancerous. Usually you get results within 24 to 48 hours after the biopsy has been done. That's similar to the uh, time delay that uh, you have with the typical core needle biopsy that's performed with ultrasound or stereotactic guidance. The patients that I have put through this process always come back to me and say, you know, I would rather go through that. I'd rather have a little bit of anxiety about whether or not this is a cancerous thing that's lighting up on the MRI. And I'd rather have a little bit of discomfort to have the core biopsy approach done and prove that it is in fact benign because I feel like then perhaps we've done everything we can possibly do to screen me as adequately or as accurately as possible for breast cancer. Ann Jansen, today's THV.